going on, fam? Just making sure I'm recording, because I recorded a video last time, and um, it didn't show up. All right, so what I'm trying to do now, all right, hopefully we are recording. I think we is, we should be. So what I'm trying to do now is uh, show you guys how I set up for my um, for my show. And uh, we got a show uh, this week. It's going to be a Wednesday through uh, Sunday. I believe it's going to be uh, July 26th through the 29th down at the ACOJ uh, convention. So I just want to show y'all you know how I set up when I'm at my studio how I set up my red so what I'm gonna do uh, this week I'm gonna run two softwares I don't know which one yet I'm gonna play with it tonight and tomorrow and whichever one run the best that's which one I'm gonna choose so right now I'm gonna set up in uh, main stage 3 I believe I'm uh, yeah main stage 3 I'm gonna see what we can do in that okay all right, so main stage three, what's up? Here we go. All right, main stage three loading up. <clears throat> I set up everything already, um, but it, I wasn't recording for some reason. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna keep this one, but I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna start a new one. We're gonna close that out, and we're gonna start a new one. All right. All right. So what I like to do is go here, keyboard minimum, mini, Melissa, whatever, mini Melissa. Basically, just mean that it's the it's the template with the less, you know, stuff. So usually what I do, I just go erase all this. All right, I keep this, I keep that just like that, and what I I go to all controls, and of course I need I got three keyboards I'm running. So of course I, I I'm gonna need my uh, all of them 88. So I'm gonna but right now I'm gonna just grab this 61 because that's what I got at home. I can always change the keys on the spot. Okay. All right. You know, matter of fact, let's move that up a little bit, man. Right? Take them layers down. I don't really need to see that. Take those layers down. I don't really need to see those. You can if you want, they just for show. If you want to leave them for show, you can. But I take them down. Alright. Let's take that down. My keyboard up here doesn't have. So I'm going to ungroup those because my keyboard don't have these. I'm going to erase those. My bottom keyboard I'm running don't have these. So I'm going to erase those. The one the keyboard I have at home has it, but the one I'm gonna be running at the show doesn't. It's just like a digital piano, and I'm gonna be running bottoms. But my top board do have the modulation pitch uh, pitch wheel, so I leave them on that. And uh, another thing that I do need is some knobs. I need some knobs like this. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna try to like put them here somewhere, and we'll we'll try to make them smaller. All right. Matter of fact, let's put them like that. I'm gonna drop them right there. I don't know what happened. Matter of fact, I'm gonna erase that because I don't know what happened to my other knob. All right, so leave it like that. All right, let's grab them, make them a little smaller. Bomb. All righty. Uh, maybe we could bring them. All right. They don't want to show. So we make them smaller. Ah. All right. Let's leave that there. Boom. I don't need that. So I'm going to put this there. What I'm, another thing I might do, let's see. Uh, we'll put a panic button in case something happens. Um, no, I just need one. Where's the one? All right, let's just put a button right here on the bottom. 
make it a little smaller. Still too big. There we go. Bam. All right, so I'm thinking that's all I need right now. Okay, so that's how we're going to look. All right, we're good. So we're going to go to layout. We're going to assign some things. Let's start to the top first. All right, uh, my keyboard. Let's start with the knobs. So I have a small keyboard that I'm going to use. It's actually showing you right there that I'm going to use for these faders. It has knobs on them. So I'm going to use these to control my sounds. So when I want to layer them or bring the sound in, I'm going to use these. So you make sure you hit assign. You start moving whatever you want to work. So the keyboard, I'm going to assign that to the same keyboard, but because I'm going to use those keys for something else. Let's come down to this keyboard. I'm going to assign it to my top 61 key. Let's go to the modulation. We're going to mess with those. That keyboard is set. Go down to the bottom. We're going to set it to my bottom keyboard. All right, so all keyboards set. Top, middle, bottom. All right. Bottom is 88 keys. This is gonna be an 88 key tool, but right now we'll leave it 61. Alright, so we basically ready. They got a piano what is that? A classic piano? Sound electric. Yeah, classic electric piano. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just do something quick. Even though I'm setting up. I really like using contact. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, go to contact, and I have Mater Instruments in there. I really love using uh, this one. Let's see how the gentleman sound. Can't see it. Let's see what. Let me see what the gentleman sound like. Let it finish loading. All right, let's see. I play a lot of gospel, if I ain't tell y'all. But that, that sounds pretty good, so I'm going to um, keep that, put it as a piano. I can always change it if I want. You double click this if you ever want to change, you know, change it up. Put piano. So you go here to this uh, cross a box to uh, make that. So I'm going back to the bottom to make another sound. Uh, let's see. For right now, I think I'm going to go with uh, one of Logic Rose. Let's CPU. So I really don't play it by itself, you know what I mean? So I go to one of the, grab that suitcase. Let's turn some of that bell down. Give it the damper note. Let it bring that up. That looks good. Right, then it's my girl calling me. I told her I was making a video, but you know how our wife says they don't care. All right, so we're gonna add another sound. Right now, I'm gonna just use um, I'm gonna use uh, mainstay sounds. I mean, I got sounds. You know, I run you through. Got atmosphere, contact. You know, all these, but. Right now, I want to. Matter of fact, let me go to Contact Native Instruments because I like it. I'm going to grab. Grab these session horns because they be banging. So I'm gonna just go ahead and here. 
put horns. Just quick setup, but I, you know, I'm gonna probably use this anyways. Mm, I might throw an organ down there. I, they usually have a Hammond player down there, but just in case they don't, when I get there, I'm gonna throw a Hammond in there, right? I actually like main stage Hammond, so I'm gonna use that. Uh, let's go uh, organs. They have a tone wheel. I thought they had a tone wheel somewhere down here. Um, let's see. Uh, B3. Let's put the B3 on there. All right, so. I got the B3, piano, rose horns, B3, so I put B3 here. My girl keep calling me talking about the food, ready. She, I cooked it. She didn't even cook it. I cooked it, and she called me, girl, the food is ready. And when I told her I'm going to be in here making a video trying to show you guys how to, to uh, set this thing up, or how I set this thing up, you know. I got to go to the contact again, guys. Because on that native instruments, that Scarby bass be banging. So I want to get down. I'm going to put it in mono. So I might run it to like a bass amp if I have to run. I always have stuff with me when I go out and play, you know. All right, there we go. But you know, um... <laughs> Put that on there. Yes. All right. I'm making a video. All right. All right. So that's good. I have to tell her. My, that was my. She sent my son this time to tell me. But anyways. All right. So what I'm gonna do here? Uh, I'm gonna go back to contact again. Contact five. Cause that's usually where all my stuff at. And I'm gonna go down to the C dub um, to his whoop triggers. I you know I play in church a lot, so I had to cop the the whoop triggers from C dub. Let's hit yes. I usually hit no, but I'm gonna turn the drums off because my drum will be there. Got the job, you know. And all right, so we pretty set up. You know, that's how I set up my rig. Oh, I almost forgot. So with these over here, your faders, you gotta set those up. You click on them. And my first fader, I always set to number one, my piano. You hit value, map. And you go and you move that fader again, see? Now you can see piano moving, the fader's moving. Cut it off. I mean, you don't have to. I don't believe, but I always mess up when I try to keep it on. All right, volume. Oh, make sure you click this before. All right, oh, wait a minute. Put that back on there. Let's see. Oh, see how I done switched it up. See, it's quick. All right, fist it back. That's why I say you should cut it off. So you make sure you click that again. Volume. Boom. See that? And so you want to do that step for all of them. Make sure you click that now. All right. Go to three, three volume map. Then you hit your third fader. Everything's lined up. The horns moving. Always cut. Once you get that thing set, you turn map off. So let's see. We got our horn set up. Now I'm going to my B3 which is number four, so I click four, B3, volume, map, and there go my B3. So I got basis number five, right? It don't say, but let's click five, the fifth fader, base, map, all right, there go my base on five. All right, so I'm, I, I got eight, but I'm only using six today. 
Let's go down to six, which is my triggers. And voila, we're good to go. So I'm gonna go name these triggers. Triggers, piano. All right, so let's see if we all can move them. Yeah, see, look at that. They all move by themselves. So if I wanted to play, it sound like this. That's how I set up my rig at my gigs. Church, you can turn everything down. I'll turn everything down with my B3. Got my triggers up. I don't like the way that thing sounds. I'll, I'll set it up before I play it. They got presets you can hit. Sound like a we on the um let's see uh, we hit them triggers to the J. I'm going to go ahead and save that to might use convention. And what I like to do, I don't like to make a lot of patches over here. I just like to make one or two so my computer don't have to work so hard. And I just uh, move the faders on whatever son uh, sound I want. You know what I mean? So I'm going to exit this out. Hey man, I appreciate y'all rocking with me. It's your boy A to the J, man. Y'all have a good day. Wait on main stage to save. Hopefully my video worked this time, because last time it didn't. Y'all, yeah, peace out.